25 laps the distance here for the Power Eye Lightning Sprints at I-76 Speedway. We'll work out a corner number four, the green flag. Back here to the point, out of corner number two. He'll show the way here early in lap number one. Don't count out Dakota. Dillon had good runs down at Phillips County Raceway last weekend. Lap number one to Steve Becker. Becker, Dillon, and Johnny Booster, your top three as they run down the back straightaway. Car off the racetrack. Flood gets it back onto the racetrack. We'll stay green. Top three cars, here goes Dakota Dillon for the race lead out of corner number two. Goes by Becker, Becker slid up, rolled the red carpet out. Let the lead go by to Dakota Dillon at the line, it's official. New race leader Dakota Dillon, here comes a charging Johnny Booth. Booth in that second spot, won the feature down at Phillips County Raceway on night number two last weekend. Searching, hunting in that second spot, trying to run down Dakota Dillon. Top two cars break away from the rest of the field. Half a straightaway back to Becker in that third spot. Long way back to our pole sitter, Josiah King. Dylan Boost still showing the way out front as they run one, two. Brett Reese working up through the field. He's now battling for that fifth spot, the five car. Started deep in the field, trying to work himself into the top five. Jen Woods in that fifth spot in the 86 car. Woods now catching that 13 of Josiah King, your pull sitter. Junior Thompson slow off the pace. Becker will go around him. Your race leader is working down into corners three and four. Dakota Dillon will now exit corner number four. Johnny Boos in tow as they work down the front straightaway. Gail Ingram goes a lap down. Dakota Dillon able to work that low side of the racetrack. Over in corners three and four, that thing was a mud pit. After we rolled it in, all the moisture had rolled to the bottom, nowhere for the water to go with that wall on the inside of corners three and four, as Dakota Dillon continues the lead. Brent Reese, further back in the... Oh, upside down, corner number four, red flag is out. Didn't see which car that was as it had caught air and it l tumbled a few times as it comes to rest on the top of corner number four. Driver climbing out. Dakota Dillon will start as quick out of corner number four, back to the green flag. On to the inside, Johnny Boost got up to the left rear tire, side by side for the race lead into corners three and four. On the low side is Johnny Boost, Dakota Dillon fights back on the outside. At the line, Dakota Dillon continues the lead. They'll sell off into corners one and two, still side by side, contact. They'll keep it straight, Johnny Boost goes by for the race lead. On to the inside, here comes Dakota Dillon, contact to the left rear tire. Halfway home, Dakota Dillon now got some work to get back by. Johnny Booth shows the way, Dakota Dillon second, Becker now third. Don't count out Dakota Dillon, dig it on that lower groove of the racetrack. Johnny Booth got underneath the 39X, contact allowed him to go by the 39. Again, boosts up high. Dakota Dillon running on the lower line. He's gaining ground on your race leader. He's cut it down to a car length advantage. No to tail in the corners, one and two. Boost able to extend that lead, a handful of cars. And they'll work in a corners three and four. That's where Dakota Dillon's making up his time as corners three and four, much quicker through that lower groove. Battle for the lead, Dakota Dillon drives in deep, looking for the race lead out of corner number two. Dakota Dillon back to the point. Great race here for the Power Eye Lightning Sprints is Dakota. Dillon now back out front. Didn't give up was Dakota Dillon. Back to the inside. Johnny Boos goes by. 
Swaps it once again, Dakota Dillon. Back to second, Johnny Boost now at the point. Dakota Dillon lost some ground. Had to get around the lap car of Gail Ingram. He's got a lot of work to do to get back to the rear tailpiece of Johnny Boost. Again, Dakota Dillon down low, working that lower groove through corners three and four. Catching the tail end of the lead lap is your race leader, Johnny Boos. Gonna allow Dakota Dillon to drive up rather quickly to the inside. It's Johnny Boos contact. Your race leader gets in the 81, collects the 44 Raider off the back straight away goes Johnny Boos. Back to the point is Dakota Dillon. Johnny Boos driving the wheels off it. Dakota Dillon now shows the way, trying to put Balderson in a lap down. Slow car now in the back straightaway, just in front of our race leader. Dillon working the outside lane. Johnny Boos now back within striking distance. Top two cars, one, two. Now to the inside goes Johnny Boos. Contact once again. Johnny Boos has done all but use up the whole right side of that race car. Boos drove it in hard to the inside of the 39 of Dakota Dillon. Laps winding down here for the Power Eye Lightning Sprints here tonight. Dakota Dillon's got a dig to get back to the point. Working out of corner number four, your race leader, Johnny Boos will grab the white flag one more time around. And caution flag is out. And this is gonna be an interesting run to the finish. Green light flashing down the back straight away. About ready to fire us off, taking us to the checkered flag. In hopes we can go green to checkered here with a couple laps. We'll work out a corner number four, back underway for the Power Eye Lightning Sprints. Boos out of corner number two, extends that lead a couple car lengths. Dakota Dillon back to the inside, as is Johnny Boos this time through corner number four. White flag is out one more time around. Johnny Boos out of corner number two will take us down the back straightaway for the final time and work in the final set of corners here tonight. Johnny Boos will exit corner number four to the checkered flag here at I-76 Speedway. Dakota Dillon's into that second spot.